Hello, we're here with the all-new 2015 WRX STI, and we're in the Isle of Man. And as you can tell, it's a, a bit of a special STI. Um, we're here to show off our all-new car. We've got an all-new chassis. We've done a lot of work to redesign this to make it the best STI ever and the best handling STI ever. Let's take a look at this car in particular. We're going to notice a few changes. We've got some transponders on here for tracking its course around the track. We've got a fire suppression system attached to the car we've had to do for safety reasons. The gold BBS wheels, which are very familiar to our U.S. customers with our new launch edition we've done, but uh, essentially our goal here is to run uh, a stock STI on the Great Isle of Man circuit. It's a 37-mile circuit run. It's an extremely challenging run for us. We set the lap record here three years ago. We've come back here to reset that record with this car, um, essentially a stock STI, but we have made some con concessions in terms of safety here. Uh, one of the things you notice right away, we've got new, some new Dunlop Dereza tires. Uh, the reason being, we're running at above 160 for extended periods of time. We need a tire that can handle that. Also, the course does drop way down into very slow speeds, into the 40s or so through some turns when you go through the towns here on the Isle of Man. So we've modified that with these, these custom tires, but it runs on a stock wheel. We are running stock Brembo brakes as well. We've changed out the pads though for, for, for safety reasons as well. When you come around and take a good look at the interior, it's probably where the most change has gone on. You know, this is the first time we've ever actually caged one of the new STIs. We did a lot of work with this all new cage. This FIA spec for safety reasons. We've got uh, racing seats in here as well and harnesses. Once again, a big safety concern for us was Mark's safety and having him okay just in case there was any kind of an issue here on the track. We've improved the chassis underneath with a stock car. That means the improvements are carried over here to the, to the car we're racing today. It's a 40% stiffer frame on the new STI. It gives, makes us a much more stable uh, in terms of how to design the suspension around it. We, we've got the great base setting now and it, you can really feel it when you're driving the car. The other big difference is this has an all new uh, steering rack. It's got a 13 to one steering rack. It's hydraulic steering on this car. It makes it a much better car to drive, much quicker feel. Everything else those standards. The real stuff that goes on is the chassis work, like we said. That's what STIs are known for, and that's what we carry over here. We've got a six-speed. Uh, it's a basically a hand-built ice and race box for all STIs that we use. That's that standard as well. And we've got uh, four four different differentials. That's where the real work goes on with our symmetrical all-wheel drive system in conjunction with the boxer engine. So you've got a, a essentially a mechanical helical style diff up front. We've got two center diffs, one electronic and one mechanical, and then a torsion diff in the rear. These are all controlled by a computer and that computer essentially is a, a portioning uh, torque and traction wherever it sees fit. And especially in a course like this where Mark is going through so many different types and variables of road surface here, it's very, very hard work on the system, but we think a great test of it as well. The other big change that the Isle of Man is asked to do in terms of safety reasons, uh, make it louder. That's pretty easy to do on a, on a boxer engine. All we did was add a straight pipe to the car. And then of course, we've also modified the ECU. We've removed the electronic limiters in terms of top speed. We want to hit about 164 here. That's our goal, right in that area, 163, 164. Uh, typically, we limit the speeds down into the 150s because in terms of a customer car, we never know what the condition of the tire is. We're using higher strength tires here. That's, that's going to help us out a lot. One other thing we made in, con in consideration in terms of safety, as if anyone's ever seen the last video that we, we shot here at the Isle of Man, Mark Higgins had out there it was a uh, suspension. We've got a ProFlex suspension on this. So essentially, it's our stock suspension setup. We've just changed out the damper and springs with some ProFlex uh, setup. Uh, other than that, that's the same. And uh, pretty much that's it. it. It's hoping a little bit better aero this time on the car because we've got an all new body, of course. This is the only car we're going to sell right now. It's going to be all sedans in terms of uh, Subaru STIs. But that's our TT Challenge 2 car. Thank you. Control to mark, control to mark. We have the green light. Good to go, good to go, good luck mark.